guys and welcome back to another cooking video okay so today um, I'm gonna I looked okay I spent the past like hour it's almost seven o'clock now at night not in the morning obviously um, I spent the past 20 minutes looking for a biscuit recipe and I couldn't find one that I could eat so um, and then I was like oh I'll make some cookies and then I looked for like ever and then I was like, oh, I can't find any cookies I can eat. And then I realized, I have my own recipes. So then I went to my own YouTube channel and watched one. Well, I didn't watch it. I just looked. I, I do not watch my own videos. I get, like, too cringy. I just edit them, upload them, forget about them. That's that's how you got to do it on this um, platform, you know? So um, I'm making cookies today. And I took one of my recipes I already had and just kind of switched it up a little bit so that I could put chocolate chips in it. Just had the scariest moment of my life. Um, there was some chocolate chips in the same bag, but they were milk chocolate. I spit it out, I washed my mouth out, I didn't brush my teeth, but. Anyway, so let's get started. So I'm making chocolate chip cookies. Probably saw that in the video title. I should probably preheat the oven, and I didn't look at how much to preheat it. 350 is always good, right? I'll do 350. Um, I've actually made um, on one of my channel on my channel on my channels on one of my videos I actually made something with um, the Vitamix lid inside the oven so um, that was not a good thing so now I always look inside and make sure there's nothing in there and we're gonna start off with um, one fourth cup of almond flour and um, this is obviously contaminated in here I don't know what's in it but I'm gonna if I've risked my life once today I might as well risk it again two. Now, obviously, in case you didn't notice, um, I did not set up, um, didn't make this fancy because I was just going to make cookies, but um, for the past couple days, I've been like, oh, I should vlog today, and then I didn't, and then a bunch of exciting things that would have been great for a vlog happened, but one half teaspoon baking soda right here. Um, I'm not sponsored, so I don't want to show any brands, you know. Okay, put this away. I like to put stuff away as I go. I'll be right back. I'm gonna put this away, so I'll be right back. I heard some music out there um, on the golf course, and I was like, oh, I wonder who's having a party. It's so annoying. And then I realized that um, my own school is having prom over there. So, <laughs> I mean, my old school, I'm graduated. Next is the one fourth teaspoon of salt. I like to kind of keep it a little bit because I like salt. I think it tastes good. One fourth cup shredded coconut. Do we have a one fourth? Oh, I can just do four tablespoons. Math. Honestly, if these don't turn out, like, it's not gonna hurt me if I still eat them. Like, cause it doesn't matter if they don't take shape or something like that, because I can just, you know, do whatever I need to. Um, next is, this is something I added that's not in the original one. One fourth cup chocolate chips. I'm gonna do this again. Now these are um, chocolate chips I can have, it's just, well, kind of can, kind of can't. There's um, sugar in them, but like, I like risking my life apparently, and um, I like to eat sugar, so. I mean, a couple, if I eat like three chocolate chips and a cookie, I'll be fine. I'm gonna go put these away, and I'll be back. You know, I thought I was really original with cooking with Clara, but then I was watching like some other cooking videos on the internet. I saw some other things that are like cooking with blah, 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 cooking. I was like, maybe I'm not original. I got it from a radio show that I used to listen to when I was younger. There was actually a segment called Cooking with Clara. And I don't really know why it was called Cooking with Clara because it was a radio show. You weren't watching anything and they did not teach you how to cook. I'm going to throw this away and wash my hands. Um, you want to hear about my exciting day that I did not vlog yesterday? Wait, let me just put in vanilla. Oh, and I also need honey and coconut oil. All my wet ingredients. One teaspoon of vanilla. Oh, the oven's ready. Also, I have no idea how I'm gonna edit this because it's gonna be a long video. Usually, I just I film the videos like straight in a time lapse and the like just easiest things to edit. Okay, a little life hack for y'all. So I need to put honey in this, but um, I, in case you don't know, honey's really sticky. But I also need to put oil in this. So if I put the oil in this thing first and I put it in here, you know, support your local YouTubers. I, I'm thinking about coming out with merch. I was thinking about like, saying like spicy and then like this, an outline of like the top of my head like this. 
my hand like that, but like not my real face, like an outline of it. I was thinking that would be good merch. I microwave this. I'll see you in a little bit. I don't want to get um, radiation, so I'm going to move that here. Okay, it needs to be stirred again, but also I have to be careful like not to cook stuff too much if you oil too much if you're gonna add it to eggs same with butter probably but um i think that um you can scramble up your egg if you add something too hot to um eggs so um yeah let's we'll do this okay okay let me tell you about my day yesterday so um first of all i woke up and then i went to school with my mom and my brother my mom teaches so she went and then my brother takes classes so he went and then my mom was going to take me to college classes after that and then i went in and said hi to some of my friends and i was like okay i could be vlogging right now but you know it's okay and then i also like thought like oh these i could get some good shots of like me putting on my shoes and stuff i know <laughs> good footage you guys want to see that and then i went to school so I went to school and they ha it was Spring Fest and I knew they had Spring Fest, that's why I wanted to vlog. But um, they had um, a petting zoo and I got to hold a kangaroo and I'll put a picture of that on the screen right now so you can see that. Actually it was a wallaby, sorry. Um, I just feel like a kangaroo sounds better but um, it definitely was a wallaby. Um, and yeah, I talked to the people that have the, have the wallaby and I was like, um, why is this wallaby in captivity? Like, Cause they're like, oh we're raising it for captivity. And I was like a little bit shook, but then um, they explained why. And it seemed like a good reason. I don't know. Um, they didn't want to ship it back to Australia. I don't know if that's a good enough reason to keep an animal in captivity. But um, I like to hold it. I don't know if you can understand anything I say. Because sometimes I forget to enunciate my words. Okay, so I have egg and vanilla and coconut oil in here. Um, so I'm going to stir this all together. That looks like cookie dough. Before it has dough. Uh, like, oh, it's doughing up. Oh, then it's kind of working. What if I added another egg? Definitely did something wrong. Honestly, these don't turn out. Like, it's not going to hurt me if I still eat them. Like, it's, it doesn't matter if they don't take shape. I feel like this is really dry. It doesn't matter if they don't take shape or something like that. One, okay, I need, I need to stop this so I can look up what would happen if I added another egg. Like, I'm all about experimenting, but, like, I actually want to be able to eat these, you know. Here's what it looks like right now. It, like, it can't really see me very well. I'm tempted to just add either a little bit more oil to this. Because I did take a little bit out. But, like, I'm going to make a batch. Should I only cook four cookies first and see if it turns out? I don't want to cook a whole pan of cookies. Um, if they don't turn out, I'll just cook the whole thing. I gotta make a thumbnail. Okay, that should be good. Got to chop that chip on the loose. Anyways, I'm gonna set the timer for uh, seven minutes. And I don't want to edit more than 30 minutes of footage, so um, this is it for all. Oh, the lighting's really bad. I didn't get better. Oh. If you watched the video this far, um, comment down below the little chili pepper emoji. You know how I said the cookies weren't turning out? I forgot honey. Oh, and I also need honey. So now I have like that much batter left, and so I'm going to add honey to that. But um, the six cookies I put in there, they have no sweetener in them at all. Honey. So they're not even cookies. So um, we'll see how those turn out, and I'll update you guys in a bit. Okay, okay, now it looks so much better and it actually looks like cookie dough. And um, it, I was missing an ingredient. I should just uh, like know like, oh, they aren't turning out. You're missing an ingredient. But um, yeah, so next time I know. And I'll update you guys in a bit. I just filmed the whole segment. Me eating the cookie and talking to you guys about how sometimes you make a mistake. And God uses those mistakes for the good because now I know how to make biscuits. And I wasn't recording any of it. So, that was fun. I always forget to vlog like real vloggers. So, um, it turned out really good and it tasted really good. And um, if you have the chance to make uh, biscuits just, and just add chocolate chips, go for it because um, it tastes really good. So, 
Thank you for watching. Um, I may film another clip. You never know at this point because I said bye like three times. So I'll see you later. Here's how the last batch turned out. As you can see, I burnt them. And also the honey made them like get darker because like these ones are um, pasty. But um, these ones look like real cookies.